Becca, welcome back to my channel where I share with you guys tons of content on my pregnancy, lifestyle, clean beauty, all kinds of stuff like that. Today I actually have my monthly Young Living haul, which, whew, I like can't talk, I'm so pregnant, I literally cannot talk. Um, it is actually my July order, but I ordered it so late in the month that it literally came today, which is August 1st. This video might not go up for a while though because I am trying to kind of pre-film a little bit for the fact that we have no idea when this baby's gonna come at this point, so bear with me. But I just wanted to share with you guys what I got this month from Young Living. Um, if you don't know somehow, I'm a Young Living member. I have a playlist down below for all of my Young Living unboxings and I also have like a what I oil in a day playlist. So I do a lot of different essential oil style videos here and there. Uh, that you can check out and if you subscribe you won't miss another one but let's get into this haul so i actually uh i've been keeping my orders a little bit smaller when i can just because with a baby coming i have a lot of money going to baby things which last month i got a bunch of seedlings items so this month actually is food heavy which is a little weird but i'm trying new stuff but starting out the first thing that I grabbed is my Thieves toothpaste. This is the Aroma Bright one. I'm kind of liking this one better now. I used to like the Denturum way better, but now I'm kind of liking the Aroma Bright. Um, it's actually funny though, because I don't think I ordered it last month. So I actually ran out last night. I used my last little like sliver of it left and I was like, oh no. Um, but then it came today. So now I have toothpaste again. They actually just came out with a new whitening toothpaste. And I think I'm going to order it next month when it goes on to ER because it was only on quick order this month uh, because of convention. But really excited. I want to try the new one for sure, but I love my, my Thieves toothpaste. The next item I've hauled a couple times in the past few months. This is the Cell Light Magic Oil. It is a massage oil that has a bunch of different oils in it. Um, it has a lot of carrier oils and essential oils. It does come with a pump, although I don't always use the pump. A lot of ladies claim that this really gets rid of their like cellulite visibility on their legs and butt and stuff like that. Um, again, I've said this before, I'm not entirely sure if it's done that for me, but I actually have mainly been using it on my belly now. This is my main belly oil and I'll add some other stuff to it, but this is what I've been using to hopefully prevent stretch marks and honestly so far so good. I'm almost 37 weeks the day that I filmed this video, so I mean so far so good, we'll see, but I really enjoy it. I like the smell, I like how it feels. Um, and I like how it is on as a belly oil. Um, in it though, there is a uh, capra triglyceride, there's grapeseed oil, grapefruit, cypress, uh, cedarwood, juniper, wheat germ oil, clary, sweet almond, and olive oil. So lots of good carrier oils, lots of good essential oils. I really do enjoy this product so far. Um, the next item, getting into the food, I got a couple of items. I have gotten this before. This is the Einkorn Granola. Um, I think I've mentioned, it's not my favorite granola I've ever had. I do enjoy granola, like different granolas from the store, and I try to get natural and organic as much as I can. Um, but I do like this one, so I figured I'd grab it again because I kind of want to make some sort of like breakfast bars or protein bars or so I want to make something with it um because I usually will put it into oatmeal or put it into yogurt or something but I kind of want to make something with it so this has crunchy einkorn clusters old-fashioned oats nuts seeds berries and cacao nibs and it's naturally flavored with vanilla extract and sea salt but yeah I I do enjoy it it's not the best one I've ever had in my entire life but it's it definitely actually has a unique taste I do enjoy it I like granola so I figured I would grab one and it does last me a while all right the next item I grabbed here is actually the einkorn cereal which is really weird but I realized that like I really haven't tried a lot of the food products from Young Living so I was like you know what why don't I just do it why don't I try more of these products it, it never hurts to try them and they are always very healthy and natural products. So um, it's non-GMO, there's no artificial colors, flavors, or preservatives, and it's the, uh, and if you want to know, let's see, with einkorn, it actually has only 14 chromosomes, which compared to modern hybridized wheat, it has 42 chromosomes. So this is just something that's like a lot simpler. I don't know if that makes a difference on people that um, are gluten-free or not. I'm not sure, but I would potentially look into it if you're someone that has to be gluten-free. I don't know if this would make it easier because it's such a simple form of like wheat. I don't know if I'm making sense. I might as well try it. 
honestly, this is like a really natural, clean, but still good tasting like Frosted Flakes. And it's minus all of that horrible like sugar and stuff that's in Frosted Flakes, but that's what it reminds me of. So I actually think I'm gonna enjoy this. I just figured with going into the postpartum period, I'm gonna want a lot of easy stuff like that, and cereal is so easy. The last item I grabbed though is actually the Einkorn Pancake and Waffle Mix. Um, if you saw my video two months ago, I got the uh, the syrup from Young Living, the Ninja Berry syrup. So I was thinking about it, and I love my Kodiak cakes and all, but I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try their pancake and waffle mix. Uh, I love making waffles, I love making pancakes, I love putting different stuff into them and kind of like experimenting with flavors and stuff and I do have the Ningxia Berry Syrup. So I was like, you know what, we're going to try this out. So I will let you guys know soon. Hopefully I'll do a like fade, find and fail video with my Young Living products soon or even an empties video so I can share more about how I've been loving the products that I've been grabbing the past couple of months. So let me know if you want to see that and comment that down below though because I will forget. So remind me, if you want to see a fake find and fail or an empties with Young Living products, let me know. But anyways, that is it for my little haul for this past month with my Young Living ER order. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know what other essential oil videos you might want to see. But also check out my other videos on my channel. I've documented my pregnancy, and I also do a lot of like lifestyle and clean beauty as well. Um, but that is it for this video, and I will see you guys in my next one.